Well, the Supreme Court today gave the Indian Cricket Board, the BCCI, an ultimatum to reform or face the music. But the board refused to give an undertaking that it would abide by all the recommendations of the court-appointed Lodha panel for reform. The angry Chief Justice then said the court will now pass an order, perhaps tomorrow. This means the entire BCCI could be sacked and replaced by a court-appointed panel instead. The Supreme Court came down hard on the BCCI today. After the BCCI told the court that they respect the top court, the Chief Justice of India, T.S. Thakur, told the BCCI, don't just say you respect us, show your respect for us in deeds by accepting the Lodha panel recommendations. The court also asked the BCCI to give an unconditional undertaking that they will accept all the recommendations by Friday. The BCCI though tried to fight back, saying that they will not be able to furnish an undertaking by Friday. And that's when the Chief Justice angrily told the BCCI that if they don't give an undertaking, the court will be left with no option but to pass an order. BCCI's defiance has riled up the Supreme Court, which is now all set to pass an order as early as Friday. And that could very well mean the end of Anurag Thakur and his group of administrators in the Board of Control for Cricket in India. Earlier, the court had in fact reminded the BCCI that their money is money collected from the public and they are discharging public functions, so they have to be held accountable. This could affect future of cricket. The battle is over long tenures, state cricket associations having more than one vote, whether the BCCI funds is public money. The whole cleanup began three years ago during the spot fixing scam. With Arunachalam Vedyanathan and Rika Roy in New Delhi, Akash Das Gupta for NDTV.